Yeah, there's a couple of people not muted. There's a couple of people not muted. If you can please mute yourself, that would be appreciated. That's Salma. And who else is there we have? Salma, can you please mute yourself? And anyone that's not got their proper name up there, because I'm not calling anyone. Sorry, Sister Pauline. I just muted everyone. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. That's fine. That's fine. I can understand why you did it. I can understand why yeah. you did it. Um, Salma needs to be muted, um, Brother Ambi. Mm. But maybe uh, she doesn't. Maybe she doesn't even have a mic, so it's a possibility she doesn't even have a mic. I'll have to check that. But please yeah, put okay. your name um, of who you are, not your device or a pet name, because we like to know who we're speaking to here. Um, just be appreciated and just respectful. So on that note, back to you, Bagambi. Thank you very much. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, everyone, and um, thank you all so much for making making the time to be here again this evening for the daily briefing. Um, we, we, we have a few things that we want to, to look at today. We know that um, when, we, when we ended yesterday, we had about three people who had questions that we, had, we, had, we did not deal with yesterday. To start off today, we are going to deal with those three people. And then, Sister Pamela, are you there? Okay, I can see her hand is up. Sister Pamela, are you here? I am here, yes. Okay, I'm listening. And, you are on, and you are on your laptop? I am on my laptop, yes. Great. So, after we take the three questions, we are going to go to Sister Pamela and she will show us where she's going, she's getting lost so that we can guide her to resolve the issues that she has. Okay. And then from there, we're, you know, we're hoping to get two people to come on today. I'm st we're still not sure, but if by that time they are not here, we, we still have a very full program. Uh, for this evening. Um, in the meantime, I would want to also just go a little bit into um, the, the country structures that we are putting in place um, across the entire network, you know, uh, on the continent, in the diaspora, for people who are in a country that you are not sure about how the country structures are or who are the people, who are the parties that are involved in putting in place the country structures, please um, reach out to us through the support group. Um, Brother Elat, who is our leader uh, on the country structures. I don't know if he's here tonight. Brother Elat, are you there? Um, okay, I think he's not here yet, but no, no, he's, he's our not, leader. No, he's not he's here our yet. Yeah, he's our leader on the country structures and already putting in place some really interesting structures in different parts. Um, I see Maurice, Maurice Tembu. We are, you know, we're still waiting for the details from Malawi. Um, uh, Sister Emma and brother Samuel, we started doing some work today. We are going to complete it. I've seen that uh, Brother Sam will return my call later, but we've been, you know, we are going to um, complete the work we started with you guys today. Um, Senegal is just about set, as I've said all along. Uh, Burundi as well, Brother uh, Gilbert. Uh, we have also, we received a comprehensive agent list actually spread all around the country. Very, very impressive work that's going on there. So for all the countries where we still to have proper, real, solid structures, uh, please uh, reach out so that we can, we can, we can start you know, mapping it out and making it work for for the country. Um, I think 
Dr. Linus, good evening. Before we get into all of this, good evening to you. Good evening. Good evening, Brother B. Good evening, uh, everybody um, from wherever you're dialing in around the world. We, we know we always have an international uh, mix of, of participants uh, within the community, which we're very blessed for. Uh, thank you very much for making the time uh, to join this evening. We had uh, hope that one of our senior executive members who actually spent some time recently in South Africa in one of the kingdoms would join us together with somebody from the kingdom to come and just give a brief talk of what is happening, what is happening there in relation to the adoption of the Lumi. Um, he may still come in. He has confirmed that he will come in, but he was trying to get confirmation of, of a representative from the kingdom who could also join. So I will just um, step in and, and, and introduce him when he does come in. I don't see him just yet. I think he's still trying to talk to the representatives there to see who else can join him, if there is anyone indeed. Um, failing that, as Brother B said, we have a, a, a program that we can go through this evening. And always a reminder for me, uh, in terms of the reasons we are gathered to address the challenges of inclusion, and the use of a common instrument of exchanging value across the community, uh, both within continental Africa and between those in continental Africa and the rest of the African diaspora or the economic community of the, um, uh, the, the African diaspora, the Eco6 region. Uh, so on that note, I'm going to hand over back to uh, Brother B. It's just a brief, Welcome, without much further ado, and we will step in and introduce our brother Stephen, who had spent some time in South Africa recently when he joins the room. I'm still expecting him to come in at any point. I don't see him yet. All right. Brother B, over to you. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Linus. I think, Sister Pauline, just as a reminder, uh, we need to go through the three people that we did not uh, answer their questions yesterday before yeah. we get into anything. Yes, um, Sister Pamela is, um, I think Sister Pamela, well, Sister Pamela's one's gonna be a probably lengthy, lengthy exercise. So um, we're not ignoring you, Sister Pamela, it's just that yours, yours is likely to be lengthy. Um, we had Nano Jude. Yeah, Actually, uh, Sister Sister Pauline, if I may just interrupt. Um, yes, sir. I can see uh, His Royal Highness uh, Stephen Thomas is in the room. He just joined us. Uh, Brother okay. Stephen, uh, okay. he's the Paramount Chief. Um, may I just uh, ask you to introduce yourself, please, uh, Brother Stephen, and perhaps you give us a quick rundown of, uh, I know you've spent a lot of time in South Africa recently. Uh, in one of the kingdoms that we are working with for the adoption of the Lumi. And I thought it would be right for you to come and give us a brief talk uh, and perhaps uh, participate in a Q&A session. So without much further ado, over to you, Brother Stephen. Uh, you can introduce yourself and just give us a little talk and, and, and indicate who else is with you if there is anyone from the kingdom here with us. Uh, please, the floor is yours. Thank you very much for joining us. Greetings all and glad to be here. Greetings to you, my brother, Dr. Linus. Um, uh, just excited to be here. And um, I am uh, Senior Paramount Chief Stephen Thomas, uh, Ambassador and in, 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 in Chief there in the Bacalokwe Kingdom. Um, I had a, I apologize because I had a couple, a few things that came up in a, in a few meetings and I was not able to reach the King. Um, and maybe the next time we'll be able to have his excellence, his majesty and, uh, some of the other team to, uh, join us. Um, but it, we, we, myself and the chairman. King Rex Amako, Timothy McPherson. We 
traveled to South Africa and we were there for a couple of months and have been able, we were able to, um, we were able to uh, uh, build a good, good relationship there. Um, the kingdom of uh, the Bakalokwe kingdom um, has been issued by the government of South Africa, a royal, a, a royal trustee. And I don't know if everyone knows what a royal trust deed is, but you, you do not just happen upon a royal trust deed or go like a family deed. A royal trust deed is when the government do their due diligence and confirm that you are, that indeed it is a kingdom and you're the king. And they issued him a royal trust deed with full rights of having their own currency and their own um their own currency and their own courts. And so uh, King Lassessa, the king there uh, has declared that Lumi is the official currency of the kingdom, which is about 5 million plus uh, people based on the last census in the kingdom. And um, we are now registering people there to be a part of um, the, 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 the movement here with, with the partnership with uh, the kingdom and Eco6. Um, one of the things that has happened is that we're now taking on businesses uh, and municipalities. We have municipality uh, where the mayor is, is on board and their, their staff, the mayor's staff, is getting um, paid in Lumi. And what we have done is that we have the, the, the King and, 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 and Eco6 have established a basic minimum wage for um, the people in Bakalokwe Kingdom. And this is also something that we will use throughout the kingdoms, being that what we're doing in Bakalokwe Kingdom, we went into it with the idea that it would be the pilot for all the other kingdoms. Uh, I'm sure uh, Dr. Linus have let you all know, uh, share with you all that through our tour in 21 and even on last year, we one of the issues that we have constantly ran into was that of, uh, of governments that was ready, willing and able, ready, ready and willing um, to move forward in, in the citizens. But the problem was they were not able because of the government within the government, the central banking system. And so we have decided that um, the best way forward is instead of trying to deal with the governments at, at hand, to go, to go forth with that that was there before there was ever a Nigeria or South Africa, the kingdoms. And those of you that are on the continent, you know that the, some of the most respected people on the ground are the traditional leaders. And so um, in doing that in, in our partnership, we have been able to uh, get a lot of, lot of good ground and a lot of good footing. And so one of the, and, and, in, and, and in, to go back to what I was saying, we have implemented a minimum wage of the parity value in our Lumi of 1,700 Rand, um, 17,000 Rand a month. And when you have people that's making four or 5,000 at best uh, a month, uh, that is a serious upgrade. And to keep from shocking the, the, the system, what we have um, said was that we will, the people that are getting paid in RAND, the companies and the businesses that will come on, will continue to pay their, their, their staff what they were paying them in the local currency, uh, I mean, in the other currency um, of RAND being in this case. And we would subsidize the difference because we know that a lot of the businesses cannot uh, pay the difference. So we will subsidize the difference in Lumi. So let's say if you were, if you were making five thousand rand a month, you would continue to get that, get the, get that in rand. 
from your job. So it do not disrupt, disrupt your life at, at all. But we would also subsidize the other 12,000 in Lumi. Of course, there's a lot of excitement around that and a lot of movement. And so there, not only do we have the mayor that was the first one to step up, but there's other mayors that have now started coming forward. And um, I haven't, Dr. Linus, I haven't had a chance to let you know, but tomorrow um, morning, my time, <laughs> uh, there will be a, 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 the mayor is hosting a rally for, for, for Lumi. Uh, in an auditorium, and there will be a minimum of a thousand people in in attendance. And we will be registering people. There's other people that that's already registered. We will also be uh, informing them of the way forward. One of the things that we that we kept hearing was, "When can I spend my Lumi?" and uh, uh, um, "Why can't I spend my Lumi?" And so we we said, because we know that that is a question then why not become proactive and, 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 and use that as our power? Because the issue is, why can't we? Given that, uh, it, it, because the, the, the Lumi is being hindered, the, the, the Reserve Bank, um, uh, the government of South Africa issued Bakaloko a kingdom, a royal trust, and now they don't want to honor it because they, I guess they thought they'd never use it. But legally, they have signed it and it's, it's legal, it's binding. And so um, we have them in the uh, regional court of ECO-6, um, which is also historic because this is the first time in, um, in 400 years that this colonial system have been in a court that they do not control. Um, and being that we are the six regions with all full legal rights, we have the same rights as SADAC, ECOWAS, or whatever to have our courts. And being that SADAC disabled their court, and we have made an investment in Bacalokwe Kingdom with a partnership, we were the ones that Bacalokwe Kingdom appealed to and opened up a case and had been in full um, communication with the Reserve Bank of which we served a restraining order in which they uh, re they did stamp uh, receipt the, the 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 attorney general the attorney's office stamped it the office of the president stamped it the Reserve Bank signed it and the Minister of Finance office stamped it and so they all received the 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 restraining order we they hired the number one law they law firm in South Africa to represent them in court of which they uh, there was a lot of information they were not aware of. And so uh, we were able to educate them because they are the ones, and, and I want you to hear this, they are the ones that in their argument brought up that the only regional uh, entity that they identify in, in converting currency is the African Central Bank. Um, but they did not know and we informed them that we have a treaty with the African Central Bank and that um, we have a treaty with the African Central Bank and that Lumi is the official currency of the African Central Bank until the African Central Bank uh, comes up with its own currency. And once they have their own currency, Lumi will be remain the official currency of the diaspora with full rights of conversion. So there is, <laughs> so we have full legal rights right now, truly, to go across the continent uh, to use our Lumi across the continent. And so, being that this is a pilot, we set in motion um, to be proactive. And so, what we're doing now is, um, we're to, even tomorrow at the rally, we will be motivating the people. We will be signing them up and then also informing them of their legal rights and that the, the Reserve Bank of South Africa is in contempt of court and it, they are illegally functioning in the Bacalokwe Kingdom. And they, there is an injunction that has been, been given to them. And so Bacalokwe Kingdom uh, has all legal rights. So we're gonna inspire the people, encourage the people to, 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 to sign a petition in support of Bacalokwe Kingdom, and 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 and, and to 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 and, and we're going to let them know the the issue is they're hindering us. So instead of being a 
a victim or saying, why can't, why can't I use my Lumi? When can I use my Lumi? And they're asking us, uh, we're saying, no, ask the right people. As a matter of fact, do not just ask, demand the right people that the Reserve Bank and the government of South Africa that issued a royal trust that states clearly in it that, they, that, that the kingdom can have its own currency and its own courts, demand that they honor their, their words. Because in several of the uh, uh, municipalities, there have been no running water for about three months. Um, the municipalities are bankrupt. People are working and not getting paid. And so we must demand that we can immediately use the release that Eco6 is bringing to the table that will give us not only uh, a salary, but that will give us two, three times the salary that we were making, plus uh, will bring the industrialization that we desire. Um, just this past Monday, we had a great meeting with a solar company there in Bacalokwe Kingdom that has has agreed to start a pilot project of five megawatts and we're going to roll out into much bigger but as a pilot five megawatts completely 100 percent using lumi and they themselves will work on doing whatever they have to do for conversion but because they see the big picture and where it's going they're willing to they, they are um they will begin a a project in um Bacalokwe Kingdom using Lumi, uh, a solar project using utilizing Lumi as its currency. Dr. Linus. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Thank you very much. And just as a reminder, that was Senior Paramount Chief Stephen Thomas, an ambassador of Bacalokwe Kingdom. Uh, they have spent recently over nearly two months or more in within the kingdom, strategically interfacing with the kingdom and the king and its and its people and and structures within the kingdom to actually pull this mammoth task off. He was there with Chief Timothy McPherson, as you know, and um, like we said before, if it is said here. Then it has been said, and if there is there are any updates, then we will bring those updates to the community, and and so forth. So thank you very much, uh, Senior Paramount Chief and Ambassador Stephen Thomas. Um, please uh, welcome, uh, uh, join me in in extending our warm thanks uh, to Senior Paramount Chief Stephen Thomas. Greetings. So, are there any, uh, do you have time uh, for any Q&A, any questions and answers, perhaps? I know your schedule is very tight and you have to dash. Yes, I, I, I am going to have to go, but if there's a few questions, we can, we can try to address them. Okay, very good. So very quickly, maybe we can take three questions. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, just... Uh, Good evening, uh, Senior Paramount Chief. And uh, this is Mb here. Good day, Mb. How are you, sir? <laughs> I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Wonderful. Really great to hear your voice. And uh, it's always a pleasure to interact and to engage with you. We So as it stands right now, we have... I think one person who wants to ask a question, Ambassador Jasmine Rowe. It's been a long time. Happy New Year. We haven't seen you this year. You, ha you haven't seen me, but I've been here. I'm <laughs> dropping in. Obviously, the network sometimes. But I was here yesterday and a couple of times um, since you started. Oh, that's great. It's always good oh. to have you on. Always good. You know, Africa. Network on, network off. I, I, I want to ask. The Paramount Chief, because um, um, Chief, well done on the work that you're all doing in South Africa. Um, Bakoloku. Um, I am in Ethiopia. I have contact with the chiefs for our region. I mean, you say Paramount Chief, we they are the chiefs of the Kushites. Would it be wise um that I speak to 
our chiefs here who has a lot of control of the area to be able to introduce the Lumi within the region, within our region at presently. We do have a lot of the indigenous um, Ethiopians that are registered for Lumi also. So there's quite a large community that has, and this would encourage. What do you think in talking to our chief in the area? I think that that would be absolutely excellent. Uh, I'm sure that uh, MB and Dr. Linus would agree that is our desire to reach out to everyone and to, and to um, uh, uh, inform, educate, and then also uh, empower our kingdoms. And so I think that would be absolutely excellent. And another thing that we will be desiring also for those of you that have these kind of relationships, be, being that this is a pilot and to win, as we win this in court, because South Africa Reserve Bank now realized that they're kind of, because legally they have no nowhere to go. Um, and so, um, but what, what we want to do now is to start a groundswell. And if we can get some of you also, as we get the petition out, to have the other kingdoms and other people to show support so that they can see the Reserve Bank can see that they that there is support for and, and demand for them to obey the law, not only there in South Africa, in Bacalogra Kingdom in, and in South Africa, but throughout the, the kingdoms and the other realms um, around throughout the con continental Africa. So I think it would be great to speak with and oh, thank you so much. That's very encouraging. Can I ask also, once I set a meeting with our chiefs in the region, would it be possible to have you also on call to help us to pass the information of how it's done in South Africa? Please. We would love to. Um, I'm sure myself uh, and be Dr. Linus, and um, we, we would love to do that. We would also welcome probably uh, invite the, ch the chairman, um, King Samako, to be a part of that also. Great, great, thank you. So I will get on with that. And, and obviously I can reach you through Dr. Linus and MB. Give thanks for that, thank you. Well done on all your hard work in South Africa. It has to start somewhere. And that's one of thank the greatest you. place for it to start. Uh, yeah. thank, thank you so much, Ambassador. Thank you. Thank you so much. We have a... Uh, Mamote Saluma, uh, Seluma. Uh, good evening. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, brother Mbi. Good and... evening. Good evening, my dear sister. How are you? It's been a while. <laughs> no, I've been here every day, brother Mbi. <laughs> I think because you people come and you sit in the back. You don't, <laughs> we don't see any comments, <laughs> nothing, and you're quiet. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'll make yeah. nice next time. Yeah. Yes. Mm, good evening, uh, Your Majesty. How are you? I'm, I'm doing wonderful greetings. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, just, just a confirmation. When this is done, I'm in South Africa. I'm in the Northwest Province. That will just automatically unfold to us, right? Oh, yes. We're meeting with several of the, there's several of the kings that's already so in support and that's on board. And um, once, yeah, this, 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 this is going to go from kingdom to kingdom. It, it, it will happen very, uh, once we finish this, the rollout will be very quickly. But yes, we're meeting with quite a few kings there in South Africa and, 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 and traditional leaders. Oh, thank you so much, my king. Brother B, I'm very, very happy. This is, I can't ask for more for the whole year. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you, chief, and may you be granted that. Thank you so much. And as, so we, much. as we know that the, 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 the African Reserve Bank is not even a central bank. It is a bank that's being so, um, that, that have shareholders. And so um, our position is very strong. Thank you, Chief. Thank you so much. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, Sister Pamela, I'm not sure if your hand is up to ask a question to, to His Royal no, Highness. 
no, no, thank you. But no, um, my question oh, okay. will be for you to help me. Later. Okay, so you you are you are just getting ready for the <laughs> for the work we have to do together. That's fine. Yes. Um, so, Senior Paramount Chief, I think that's it for the questions right now. Thank you so much for dipping in. It's always a pleasure to have you guys come in from time to time to to you know to encourage the community and encourage the members from all around the world to take their time on the ground doing what they do to 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 to, to galvanize our communities and 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 advance uh, the work that that we are doing in, in parts that we are not able to reach at least for the time being thank you so much and thank you. And I want to encourage all of you that come in and that's working, your work, what we're doing in, 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 in Bacaloco in South Africa is a part of what you have done and, and your work and your diligence. We all are in this together and we're working together. And if um, my former bishop used to tell a story about there was a city that in it had this family called the Littles, but the Littles had more than everyone in the county. And someone asked Mr. Little one day, how is it that you have so much? And he looked at them and said, because all the littles do a little. And if all of us could just keep doing our part a little, then we will have a whole lot. And so I thank you. Thank you, uh, MB. I, you, I know your work have been, you've been so diligent and you all, you and Dr. Linus have worked so many hours. Thank you, Dr. Linus, for your commitment, your hard work, and thank you all. And please, uh, as we, uh, Dr. Linus and MB bring forth this petition, if you can go and rally people to have others to sign it, if you can put it on your Facebook page or whatever, and just gather all the people that we can, that this, that, that we do not, that we maximize this moment and that we destroy the back of this beast once and for all. Greet, God bless and have, a fantastic day, all. Thank you. I, I must run. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you, Doctor Linus. Thank you. Great. We have a. Um, so we're just going to. I think just as uh, uh, Senior Paraban Chief is leaving, I thought I should just read something quickly. It's, a, it's one sentence, right? Um, which uh, I'm sure it was going to explain further. Um, okay. Uh, okay, you know when I when I when I get to get it properly cleared, I'm going to read it. Hopefully before the end of the meeting. But if not, it doesn't it doesn't make a difference. Okay. Um, uh, greetings, um, brother MB. May I come in? So yeah, do, go you, ahead. do you want the names from the people that we had from yesterday? Let's yes, start with those. I want us to. Yeah, I want us to deal with, with the three people first. After that, we'll go to Sister Pamela so that she can share her screen and show us where uh, the issues are on her side. Because okay. I'm certain that when she shows what the issues are on her side, it's going to help everyone else in the meeting um, to, you know, uh, where, you, you know, who may have the same kind of issue either with Sister Pamela or with other community members that we are dealing with. Okay, so our first person is Nanu Jude Yeo. Nanu Jude Yeo. Okay. Yes, good sir. evening, Jude. everyone in the house. Yeah, Nanu Jude, yeah. Good evening. Good, good evening. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Be Jude, so before just... you, Jude, before you even say anything, be aware that I read your message fully. And I understood okay. 
Okay. <laughs> I read your message that... this evening around 7 p.m. my time, and I understood it. And, okay, sir. Um, I already tried to reach uh, uh, Brother Solomon, but he was not available earlier. But he sent me a message, a voice um, note, which I've understood. In fact, Dr. Ninos and I started discussing it, and we are also discussing it with other leaders in Nigeria. We'll come back to you guys with a decision on how we move forward with those kind of issues, okay? Okay, so we'll be happy. Was that your question? Yeah. Um, was that your question, Nanem? No. no my, my question is just a reminder about the, the issue I raised before. And Dr. Lanyu said I should create a ticket about the transaction I say I made on my Connect account to the Swiffin account. It was, I'm not seeing it in my Swiffin account, but it has been deducted on my Connect account. So when I raised the issue, Dr. Lanyo said I should raise a ticket. And I raised the, in the ticket and the support team said the, the ticket has been escalated to Dr. Lanyo because he's the only the one to... Okay, so, on the so, so just so that I, I understand you, you made a transfer from Connect to account? Swiffin account, yes. Okay, so please put your Swiffin account on the chat and um, your connect link on the chat. Okay, put it direct on, chat. Do a direct chat for Dr. Linus so that while we're dealing with the others, he can look at it. Okay, sir. Yes. Okay, is that, um, thank you, Nani. So that's, that's one question. The other one was from Nathan. Okay, I saw Nathan also in the in the room. Yeah. Nathan, you have the floor. Okay. Uh, good evening, everyone. Good evening, Nathan. How are you? Fine, sir. Fine. Uh, uh, some of the the issues I wanted to rest yesterday uh -huh. is so. Uh, it's about, um, in some previous meeting, uh, Brother Mbidi mentioned about um, training community traders, community traders that will be engaging in our, in our local communities. And uh, exactly, uh, it has not come out uh, in recent times. Yeah. Um, Is that the main thing? I, I just want to get to it straight because, um, we wanted to train to start training community traders, but we realized that access is a bigger problem than the traders. So that's why we are focusing right now on access and access and access to make sure that everybody understands that access is the center of everything we do. When we have gotten to a comfortable place with access, then we will introduce the community traders. And the community traders, there will be a certain number of requirements that we would have in place for someone to be a community trader. But we would let you guys know in due time. We've already started preparing it. In fact, um, uh, most of the leaders uh, in the, you know, some of whom are in the room now are actually already community traders but we are not, we have not put the program, we have not made the program open to the, to the entire community yet, okay? So, and, but and access is the most important thing now. Yeah, and, and just to add to that, brother, right. and just to add to that, Brother Mbi, um, uh, it, it's not just the fact that we have named them community traders, they are actually actively completing transactions every day. So when you post your request to make a transfer from account into transact, it is our internal team of community traders who are actually executing those transactions at the moment. And so when we open that up to the public, they will be there ready to train you and show you exactly what you need to do on your own account so that these requests don't necessarily have to come to the, uh, the internal trading team they can be handled by any member of the community. Just imagine 
the fact that at the moment, when you post a request for a transfer, it might take, uh, the team is very efficient now, but it could take maybe 24 hours to turn it around. Um, when we open that to thousands of community traders, you realize that uh, other, other traders or other participants within the ecosystem can pick that transaction up and, and settle it for you, or you can contact somebody specifically and you can execute that transfer. But the accounts have to be up to date first before we can open that up. So KYC is an important thing. Having your email and guaranteed access is important. Making sure your KYC is up to date is important because you wouldn't be able to participate if that is not the case. Uh, and then once all those are aligned, um, then that kind of opportunity can be opened up. Uh, perhaps Sister Lumba can, may want to add a comment on that because she's leading the transactions team. Um, uh, uh, Sister Lumba, do you want to say anything on that? In addition, I, I know it's more than answering the question, but it's just to provide that extra detail. Okay, maybe we don't have I saw her. Sister Carry Lumba on. earlier. Yeah, she's there, I, I can see her. Saw her. She's on mute, so we can carry on. Okay, oh, okay, okay, that's great. Uh, another issue is the is the difficulty in in changing the the Swiffy mailbox uh, password. I've tried that on several occasions, and uh, it demands uh, some some uh, uh, complex uh, password. Sometimes you you change it the way you feel is is very much okay, but it will still be demanding some commands and all of that. So I think uh, it somehow is a little bit uh, uh, difficult. Uh, so the technical team should 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 make it in a way that it, it will be a bit simpler, at least to our community. Uh, even uh, people at the grassroots will be able to. To, to manipulate their uh, change and manipulate their, their password in a more simpler in a more simpler way. That is a that's a very important point you have raised, uh, Nathan. Um, I think as we end up with the questions, we have I think one more person before we go to Sister Pamela. As we end up with the questions, I would want us to look at the complication that you are talking about on the change of password for emails, because that is an important part of this access we are talking about. When, the, when your email account has been created, it, our expectation is that you would immediately access it with the default password that has been issued, and then go in there and change the password yourself to, the, to your preferred password. So if there's an issue there, then we need to sort it out so that it's easy for everyone. I would want us to take a look at, at that when we are done with Sister Pamela. Okay. Is that okay, Nathan? Okay, yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank okay. you, thank you. Who is the third person, uh, Sister Pauline? The last person is uh, Peter um, Enoch. Enoch. Peter Enoch. Okay. Peter Enoch. Good evening, Peter. Good evening, Enoch. Peter. You have the floor. Can you unmute? You your, mute. Can you unmute yourself, please, sir? Good evening, Good. everyone. Good evening. Good evening, Peter. Yeah, my challenge is that uh, about two months ago, I tried to create a register to a transact account. The registration was uh, successful, but the verification email they sent to me, uh -huh. it appears, it does not appear on my, uh, my email inbox. Uh -huh. It's entirely uh, spam. So the link to do the verification, the email verifications was not there. All these were trying to, uh, to do the verification, but I couldn't do it. I went back to register again. They said the email account had been registered. So I don't know what to do to okay. uh, help okay. me. Do you have a do you have a Swiffin mailbox now? How do I register to the Swiffin mailbox? Oh, okay. That's that means, another that story. That means no. That means that's no. another story altogether. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> okay. Um, so let's come back to the Stephen mailbox when we are done with Sister Pamela. Okay, we'll sir. Go through a few things there. Yeah. Let's come back to the to the Stephen mailbox because what we would make what we may need to do is to push. Um, what do you call um, a new verification email to you? Okay, sir. But we would rather would rather do that on onto into your Swift and mailbox because we are guaranteed, we are certain that you will get you would get it in the mailbox, and then you are able to do the verification for your transact. Is that okay? Yes, yeah, sir. It's okay, sir. Or, I'm thank sorry. You very much. Can you carry on with him a minute because my system went off and I'm trying to get it back up? Okay, sir. Okay. All right. All right. Um, so. That is it. That is it for now, um, Brother Ambi. The only other person we definitely have to sort out is Peter Mutuku. Mutuku. He said, yeah. definite. I don't want him to go tonight and his issue's not being solved. He's been working all week and all last week to get this issue resolved. Um but in the meantime, okay. if you want to take anyone else on the list, then please feel free. But that was all the ones from yesterday. Okay, so let me. So what? What is the issue, Peter? You, I, I get the impression that you are close to the matter. Yes, what I, is? Yeah. It's, what it's, is? It's, what it's, is it's, the issue? It's, it's, so that it, we can it, take it. He has a Swift account. Okay. okay. His Swift mm -hmm. is um, account is fine. His transact mm -hmm. is fine. However, mm -hmm. he's unable to get into his Connect account. Now, his Connect account, um, when he puts his username in and password, it doesn't go through. Um, when he uses his email and password, it doesn't go through. It keeps telling him that a verification code is being sent. When we look in both boxes, whether it's busy Swiffing or his um, Gmail, it is mm -hmm. the verification for the email is not there. Um, we've, but, we've tried. We've tried refreshing. We've tried spam. We've tried. Okay, everything. so but on on the connect, which email address did he use? That the the Gmail or the Swift mailbox? He he. We we've tried using both, thinking that oh maybe that is his Swift account. Is his Gmail account that's caused the issue? So we've tried to log in with his Gmail. Nothing's happening. We've tried to log in with his Swift. Nothing's happening. But it would it would depend on what email address is on his profile, you know. Yeah, so, I, I, I don't know what um, address is on his, I don't know what address is on his profile. Yeah, Dr. Linus. Did we lose Dr. Linus? No, Dr. There? Linus is there, he's just muted. You are on mute. Yes, I'm You're here. Yes, I'm here. Okay. Uh, um please can we just check Peter Mutuku's profile on Connect? Okay. And see why he's unable to access. Uh, what's his um, connect username? P Matuku. Okay, P Matuku. As as as, he, as he's got it written here, I think he's he he is on tonight. Um, Peter, can you show I, I up yourself? Him. Peter, can you show I, up yourself, I, I, please? I yeah, because he is P. here. P Matuku. Okay. That's fine. Uh, he should be using the Peter dot Mutuku at inbox dot swiffen.com. That's his email that has already been updated. On his Connect account? On his Connect account, yes. Okay. Now, the other thing is that um, uh, there is there are we, uh, there are two Peter Mutukus, so he needs to perhaps he, <laughs> he's, he's trying to... Is Peter on? Yes, he is. Peter, can you he unmute yourself? Here. Peter, thank you. Thank you so much. Yes, I am okay. on. Okay, Peter, there are two Connect accounts, you can only have one. Yeah, Is, sure. Have you got P Matuku and you got P Matuku one? That's correct. Right, P Matuku one. That is that the one with the Swiffin account. P Matuku is the one with the Swiffin mailbox. P Matuku. Yes. 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 Right. So you can delete the P Matuku one then. Okay. But uh, for, for us to do that, uh, no. Doctor Linus, we need to check all the balances on P Matuku one. P Matuku one was created today. Pimu took one was a trial. Wow, when well, I was today, because we could not get through. Okay. 
So oh, what okay. is the, we okay. wanted to know what was the email address on Pima Tuku. Um, uh, because we tried both on Pima Tuku and it wasn't going through. So we, that's why we created Pima Tuku 1 with the Swiftin mailbox. And once again, it wasn't going through to, it didn't come through to his Swiftin account. Okay. We tried it refreshing, refreshing, and it wasn't happening. Okay. And okay. he logged into peter.mutuku uh, inbox. Yes. And it wasn't there. We had we had one verification code come through there, and he went on that. And when we clicked on that, you, it, it 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 gave us the authorized um, authentication number. When we submitted that, it said that um, it couldn't match up. It couldn't match up the accounts. All right. Um, okay, that's fine. I mean, it's there. I can see that is there. So, what Peter needs to do is just try to. Uh, perhaps initiate a password reset and put that email address and see what happens. When you say okay, password so reset I, I, on, on, his own, reset. On, on his um, connect account? On his connect account, yes. Okay, okay. So maybe he can do that now while we are in the meeting and let's see whether he gets communication in the inbox account email. Yeah, sure, sure. Yeah, I can do that right away. Yeah, he's very All proficient. Right. He's very quick. So he will do that very quickly and come back. Thank you very much, Peter. Right. Um, you, back Thank to you. you. Back to you, um, um, brother Ambi. If you want to go to Sister Pamela, if she's if she's ready. Uh, is Sister Pamela I'm ready? Still, I'm still trying to get my system up. I don't know what. Okay, happened. If she's not ready, let's take okay. uh, Lazarus Nazari. I see that we have, I think, three other people. Lazarus Nazari. Yes, I give thanks. Give thanks for the works. Um, my question was, um, when I used to go to the Swiftin account, I never really went to Swiftin. I would go to the the Lumi Diaspora on the internet, and it would say, oh. register your spirit. And I would click there, and it would take me to Swiftin. Now, if you do that, it doesn't take you. It, it's just, it's, it, it, it doesn't go nowhere. So a lot of the people we've been pushing to get in, involved with the Lumi and learn about it, They've been going I, on the same I know, I, Yeah, I know about the Lumi diaspora, right? But I can't, for the, you know, for the life of me, I can't remember the people who were running that platform. Dr. Linus, can you remember who was running Lumi diaspora? State of African diaspora. Okay. Okay, so um, it's... I uh, can't remember, but... It's... it's, okay. it's, it's uh, 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 PM Ketira's uh, team, I think. Oh, no, no, no. It could have been Eco Six Sector, but not the African diaspora. Okay. What needs to happen is that uh, our systems are changing a lot, as you can see. Um, and of course, of course, we did a, an upgrade about everyone knows from about December. Um, so if there were any links that were put in any websites and those links have actually changed, then they need to update their website with the correct links. With the new links. Yes. I, I so had that's one other... Why, that's why I was asking. I can't remember the, pe the person who was running it, but I know that we dealt with them quite extensively. So... Um, if if you can if you can lead us or link us to the people who are managing that that website, we would share the new links with them so that they can update their website for everyone who wants to access. Well, could you also share it in this chat so that as I um, share with people that I've already shared to get registered it's, it's, that they can get the yeah, new link? Yeah, it's the standard. It's the standard connect.swiffen.com. Very, very simple. I, I think wish, one I of the will, leaders will write, put it I'll, on write the chat. It in the, I'll write it in the chat. One so of the leaders will put it on the chat. It's very simple. I'll write it okay. in the chat. I had one other question um, based on with uh, His Royal Highness was speaking about um, the kingdom aspect in the banks. Um, I know yeah. that everything is supposed to be centered around Her Majesty, uh, the Central Bank of the Diaspora or Queen Sheba Central Bank. Um, how can we in the West, uh, like, like if, if, if we're going to push this movement, can the people in the West buy Lumi and can we push to have 
our bank put into the Western areas, just like China brought a bank to America. Why um, can we bring a bank to Jamaica, to America, to Trinidad? Can What would it take for us to push that level so that the diaspora can say, yo, this is our bank. This is the currency we're dealing with um, and, 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 and enforce so, it in that power. So, so that is something that is in, you know, there's a lot of detailed discussions that are going on at the executive level, some of which we cannot um, talk about at the moment. But all I can say is watch the space because there's a lot that is being done in the background to make sure that by the time we get to year, year five of this movement, the conversations would not be the same. And in, 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 you know, especially within the continent and across uh, you know, the, the diaspora regions, the conversations would not be the same because there's a lot of work that's going on. Um, we actually thought we should bring um, uh, uh, Senior Paramount Chief uh, uh, Stephen Thomas today, just as a, just as a, uh, you know, an intro to some of the things that are happening that, you know, we cannot bring to the meeting every day. But as we progress and we see the how advanced things are, then we are at liberty then to bring it because at this stage. There are hundreds and hundreds of people who are getting registered in the Bakoloque Kingdom. In fact, yesterday, Dr. Linus actually showed the email addresses of people, you know, not the email addresses, the, the, the Excel sheet that we are using um, to, to, to help people to get their, 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 their swift email addresses up and running as quickly as possible, you know. So, uh, and it's the same, you know, for all the, the you know, the country groups, na you know, uh, national groups, we have said for those who have uh, a problem setting up the emails, we can share that, uh, that Excel sheet because all they need to do is put the first name and the second name, it automatically creates the email address and the, and the default password. And then when it's set up on our side, you, you just go back to the same sheet, you would see whether it's done or not because it's a centralized sheet that we've created that everyone can use anywhere in the world. So, so, so your question is part of the journey, part of the, the, you know, the, the steps that we are taking. I can see that you are an author. Lazarus, I can see you are an author. What's the title of your book? The Black Rose of Kush. It's actually being converted to a film at this time as well. Oh, congratulations. Whoa. Fantastic. Yes, Fantastic. What, my suggestion to you is please do some courses for us. On Let me share my screen. Some courses for, for us on your book so that the members can benefit, some can buy. Is it on Amazon? Yes, it is. It's on Amazon. Yeah. Go on to connect, post it. I'm going to share my screen just so I can show you some of the things. Post the links of your book so that community members can follow. So uh, this is connect, right? So go in here and post, you know, maybe some summaries and whatever you want to post on, you know, on the book so that community members can pick it up. You can see community members are posting all sorts of things here. Um, and then you come here. You can see my screen, right? Yes, we can. You come here and go to instructor dashboard. And then you can create some small, you know, short courses, whether it's videos or, you know, text that community members can also benefit from. If you want the, the, you know, the courses to be, um, to be sold, we always encourage that, sell part of it in Lumi at least. And then if you want you know, the other part to be in Fiat, it's also fine. But let part of your sale be in Lumi. 
that helps to to get this move, movement forward um, in the best way possible and interacting with existing systems that are already in place. Yes, sir. Give thanks. It's a good one. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. Um, the next person is, uh, thank you so much, uh, Lazarus. Thank you. Thank you for joining as usual. Abubakar Ahmed. Ahmed, sorry. I said Ahmed. Um, good day, sir. Good day, sir. Good and everyone with an official in the house. How are you, brother? Friends, uh, how, how was everyone? So, my question today is that in yesterday, the Talinos asked, asked me to bring my email, to send him my email so that for the for him to send my coupon. So I know there is a lot of folks on him. So I don't know maybe if he forgot if he forgot or <laughs> you know what I I know, I know. You know what? Or if he sent me, maybe I I keep checking, I didn't see it on the time. So I have to ask for that. <laughs> Uh, All right. I'm thanks for out. thanks for thanks for reminding. Yes. We will send you the coupons. No, they have not okay. been sent yet. Thank, thank, thank you. Sent. Good yeah, bless you. Not been sent. They've not thank been sent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Brother B, can I share my can I share my screen and 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 you know with the permission <laughs> of um. I wonder there. Go ahead. With the permission of Ayo, Nanen yeah, Jude. Nanen Jude Right, go and talk to Linus, sorry. Nanin, Jude, do I have your permission to share my screen so we can look at your transfer requests from Connect into your account? Yes, you can. Okay, you did put through quite Dr. a few. Linus, let's just, uh, let, Dr. Linus, let's just try and keep stuff that is not... Uh, to be visible, not to be visible. Okay, that's fine. I, I won't share my screen, yeah. but I can see here there were you made five requests and they were all approved. Um, we have information on the transaction numbers. We have information on the actual time, the precise time and dates when these transactions were done. Mm -hmm. The first one was on December 29th at 15. It was done, processed. December 30th, you did another one. 3rd of Jan, there was another one, 3rd of Jan, 3rd of Jan. You did three on, th on the 3rd of Jan. And those were five transactions, all approved, all in your Swiffin account. So how come he cannot see it then? No, Jude, Jude is getting so much money. That's why he can't see it. <laughs> and, Our and, brother Jude and, is getting so many transactions. That's why he can't see the ones. <laughs> No, Maybe those ones one. are not for my. So those yeah, ones are not for my. For those that I work them on connect. So when I transfer to my Swiffin account, I pay them on transact. Oh, yeah, I you see. have made some transfers into transact already. Yes. So I used to pay them so, on so he he makes the transfer. So he's doing exactly what we have encouraged community members to do. That is fantastic, Jude. So what he's doing is that. He's helping community members from Connect who want to move money from Connect. And then he pays them on transact. That is it, exactly. You know, so he's actually already operating like a trader. Yes. <laughs> Before yes. we even get there. That's great. Thank you. These are some of the things, you know, we, and that's why these daily briefings are so important because the more we show some of the tools and all the things that people can do, it really helps. And some of the things are happening. This is, we did not even know that, that that was the reason for those transactions. My suggestion, Jude, is that maybe Dr. Linus, what you should show is how to filter so that he can filter the transactions on account to be able to see the transfers that came through. Okay, we can, uh, we can do that. So, so I've he also can sent, go to uh, his account and filter following the process that you would show. I've also sent a screenshot to Sister Pauline and Sister Pauline can share that with you, uh, Nan and Jude, for the actual specific transactions. Okay, sir. 
okay, okay. but they were done. All right. So let me uh, just share my screen very briefly, of course, with your permission. Let's just see where we can filter. Oops. You remember what happens, those sanctions. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, yeah. So uh, when you do a transfer, there is, I mean, there is this account, which is the um, the settlement account, which you can you can you can tap it in and 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 it only handles these transactions. Uh, so when you type that in and, and click search, it's an easy number to remember. It's six once, five, five times, four, four times, three, three times, two, two times, and then one. Okay. Um, we, we intend to use that for a number of different things and that's why it's it's been made simple. But anyway, if you if you don't put this filter in and you just click search, you will see, uh, Let's remove, let's remove the filter. You will see the different transfers and these are requests that you've made to transact, you see? Each one of them carries your transact account number where it's gone. And of course there are commissions, T1 and so forth. If you want to filter the transactions, what you can do is come to the top here and just click on payment type. And you can look at AKL payment and just click search. This of course will show those transactions that we were looking at earlier on, right? If you want to look at uh, stimulus payments, you can just click that and it will give you all your stimulus payments. So anyone who wants to check whether their stimulus payment in January was paid, everything now on the stimulus is up to date. So anyone who was supposed to re receive the stimulus is up to date. And for February, the payments will start on the 23rd and hopefully finish by the 24th. By the 28th, everybody would have received. So if you want to check your stimulus, then you see that that was the bonus payment that also went out. Everybody should be able to see that. And then uh, if you want to check your transfers to transact, you can click on AKL transfers to transact and then click search and you get a list of all the transfers. You've been busy. Yeah. Okay. And if you want to check just your commissions, you can look and take a list at all your T1 commissions, just click search, and it will show you all list of T1 commissions. In the case of Nanin Jude, I mean, it's 2,300 transactions, as you can see, um, and, 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 and so forth. Okay, if you just want to look at T2, you just click on T2 and click search. Um, he doesn't have any T2s. What's happening, Jude? Uh, so if you don't have T2s, okay, you might be lucky. Maybe there might be some T3s, but it will be unlikely. And then you'll be unlikely to get anything beyond that. Yeah. So, so he's getting mainly T1s. Yeah. You need to encourage other people to create accounts because yeah. if you do it this way, you don't, you don't, you lose out a lot. You you should be getting a lot of T5s. And and when we had one of our sessions um, on the social income model, which we developed ourselves you realize that you get more from T5, right? Yeah. And T4. So, and, and that is only possible when you register people who then go on to register other people. So you need to train them to go and register other people. Okay, don't try and do it yourself. It's better to so have- everyone, So everyone that you register, show them how to register someone else. Dr. Lang, can, 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 can you just go to, if you can go to his T1s, if you can go to his T1s, if he doesn't mind. Okay. Um, is that okay? Yes, sir. Uh, oops. Sorry, you'd have to give me your account number again. The Swiffin account number. Yes, please. Yeah. No, just put the name then. I might be able to get it from here. Just a sec. Okay, it, 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 it doesn't matter. What we were trying no. to say, um, Nanu, is that you see all the T ones you had registered. Yes, I see. We, uh, we all, all those T ones, yeah. All those T ones, yeah. All those T ones there. 
okay? Get those ones, whoever they are, to register someone else. Okay, the mistake that I was made is that it is for those that are first registered them. I didn't use my sleeping ID to register them. It's them that are trained in the registering people. That is why there's no T to them. Yeah. Oh, I, I see. Okay. I see. So, uh, Sister Pauline, there's something that happened in their state in Nigeria, which we are trying to resolve. I understand what, what uh, Jude is talking about. Okay, sir. Thank you. Yes, I understand. And I can I now I can see why it's like that. It's 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 something that we are dealing with at the moment. Hopefully we are going to resolve it and then you know the, the picture will be very different for his account. Okay, can okay, we just, Dr. Linus, thank you. Yeah, can, don't, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, enough. Um can we yeah. we're going to deal with Sister Pamela if she's available? If not, we go on to the next one because time is it, we all my system still not allowing me. I don't know why it's playing up today. So okay, okay. no problem. We, we just go see. to the next one. If we person. are not able to do it today, we will do it tomorrow. The next person we are going to take is would Gilbert Sister Pamela, would Sister Pamela allow us to go through? Maybe she can provide the credentials. I share my screen. We go through the exercise and see what she's struggling with and see if we can help her that way. Um, yes, it's the update for the profile that I'm supposed to be doing. It's not letting me type anything except copying the link and putting it in. And I'm Which not profile able... do you want to update? The Swiffin. All right. So the account. Uh, okay, that would be difficult. You would have to. I would have to log into your account to do that. Um, not not a good idea. Do, do you want me to log into mine? No, you don't. You she needs yeah but so it's, there's, all, all is all, the only difference is she would have to she would have to put her swift id in yes yeah, sister pauline you can log into yours and show and show and, and show right. if you can show your share your screen let me please. share my screen okay everybody can see my screen right yeah. yes okay i'm just going to log out of this Right, so you're familiar with this, Sister Pamela, right? Sister Pamela? Yes, 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 I am. I've been right. there many times, yes. Right, so you put okay. your, you put your Swiffin ID in. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yep, of course, yes. Right. Now here it says personal profile. You click on that, yeah? Now over mm -hmm. here in the corner, you have the word change. Mm -hmm. Click on the word change. And say I wanted to change um, Kent. Kent to Swanley. Yeah? Yeah. Swanley stroke Kent. Mm -hmm. Right? So I've changed that now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you, and then I have to, you have to submit it. So you click on submit. It says your, your account's been modified. I just have to move some things out of the way. It says profile modified. And I click OK. So if I log out now, I'm logging out. Yes. And I log back mm -hmm. into my account. Mm -hmm. Go to profile. Mm hmm you will see it now says Swanley Kent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The profile so, yeah. has been updated. Yeah, hold on a second. Yeah, hold on a minute. Um, so what is the problem you are having, Sister mm -hmm. Pamela? I was managed, I did manage to change my Swiffin to put my Swiffin link, in, my Connect link in there. But right. when I actually try to do the personal and the others like a member and um, the member type and no, no, these type, these ones here, you do not do. These three, the connected, the member type, and the Swiffin account name, leave a blank. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So the only information you need, the, this the information at the top, yeah, is what's brought over automatically. This information is what you need to put in. Okay. As I said, leave these three blank. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. And right. Remember, you also have to add your photo. 
okay because those who don't add their photo their transaction will be refused so once again you put change it gives you the oh hold on let me just move some things out of the way here oh hold on a second change yeah and you say add photo yeah so you click here it will ask you to choose a file so wherever mm -hmm. you have your photos stored on your file, and once again, yes, coming back to that, Dr. Linus and Brother MB, maybe I think we should put on the Connect um, platform what kind of photo we seek, because a lot of people are putting um, themselves with their full body and we can't see their face. <laughs> uh, no, I'm being serious, yeah. because their, their transaction are being denied because of that, because we can't see their face. Uh, yeah. or they're putting themselves with their baby or they're putting a cat, a dog or their favorite car. Yeah. Mm. So I think we need to just like if we go, in, I, mean, I don't know about other countries, but like here, um, they actually send you a photo uh, or a template of the kind of photo that they want to see. So I think we need to do the same because I don't think people are, and I've even had somebody sitting there reading their Bible with a candle and their face is down. <laughs> yeah. I'm being, I'm, yeah. You're, you're laughing, but no. I'm being serious. No, you know? I've seen, I've seen, I've seen some of those as well. Yeah. People putting I, their card, putting their car and all of that. Yeah. So I think we as the management team need to put something on the connect platform that says this is the profile picture. We this mm -hmm. is the kind of profile picture we need to see. So once okay. again, you would choose that here, Pam. Yeah, it will mm -hmm. take you to a file on your system, yeah, where your photos is stored. You click on that photo, whatever whatever photo is chosen. I, I pick this one. As you can see my profile there, yeah, and then you submit. Yeah. And once again, it will say it's been modified. You click OK. Okay. Okay. I've got you. I've been doing that, but I don't know what's happening, but I'll try it again. In the meantime, I cannot add anybody to my, to that same Swift friend because it's telling me error and I can't see what the error is. What do you mean telling okay, you error? So, I don't understand what error. So, so let's see. Go to brokering. Okay. Okay. If you want to add somebody. Mm -hmm. register, register member. Mm -hmm. you, just, you just go there. Brokering. Mm -hmm. yeah. Register Put member. Put their full name. Put, it there. Yes. Mm -hmm. Put their email address. Mm -hmm. And if they don't want to give you no other information, that's fine. No, I did. I did all that. But when I go to submit, it keep telling me. I did it with Peter as well. It keep telling me. And... Um, and there was an error occur, but what error is not telling me. I've done it with Peter. I've done it with other people that I try to register. Can we just put some... Why, um, I... All right, I'm going to some... send one to you, Brother Linus, um, Dr. Linus, yeah? What's your, your, your name's Linus. Just put test, put test, for example. Put test. Is, is That's your name, yeah, test? No, 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 just put test user, for example. Just, all right, just test see. user. Yes, and then for email email uh, actually let's do this i have a there is an actual email address so put inbox just put inbox inbox yes dot inbox at swiffen dot sorry inbox at swiffen inbox at, at swiffen at inbox at in, inbox dot swiffen dot com. swiffen dot com that's correct yeah. yeah that's correct right and you don't have to do anything else pam yeah, it's, if the person don't want to give you their birthday, their mobile number, whatever. That's not the problem. The, the people who have been trying to register, they have given me everything. So what is the problem? It's not submitting. It's saying okay. error. There was okay. an error. Okay, so let's have a look and see what happens when I do this then. So it says save, save and insert new member. Oh, it says save and open profile. So which one do you want me to do, Dr. Linus? Click on save and insert new member and see. Save and insert, insert new member. Submit. Right. It says here, hold on, let's just get this, some things out of the way here because I've got a lot of things open. The member has we successfully added, the member has been successfully added pending verification. An email has been sent 
uh, uh, sorry, an email has been sent to the email of Progest provided. Please open the email and click on the verification link to, ver to validate. The email needs to be validated in order to complete the transaction, the co complete the um, activation. I will just click Dr. Okay. Lino, uh, Sister Pauline. Yes, Matt. Yes. Now you, you stop sharing. Dr. Yes. Linus, please go into that inbox yes. and let's show everyone that the message has been delivered there. Okay, let me let me go there. Uh, I'm sharing my screen here. So I'm actually just going to open a blank new screen. And I'm just going to go to connect. So Pauline, can uh, Pamela give an example of one person that she, or a name and a surname, that she tried to... Um, Pete, I was one of those people and he was online with me and I've sent him photo of what was happening at the time. I've took photo myself. I have tried... Can you, can you just hold on just a second, please? Okay, so can you all see my screen? Yeah, we can. Yeah, so I'm going to go into mailbox. Uh, log into mail log is uh, I hope I can remember the password for that test mailbox, but let's say it is the username would be inbox at inbox at inbox password, in, password I leave to you. <laughs> Sorry. I said password I leave to you. Uh, yes, password. I am trying. I'm going to try and see if I, if I, if I can remember the password. Okay. Uh, no. It's saying password is incorrect. Uh, my apology. Um, I mean, um, of course, Doctor Linus. <laughs> yes. This is Ambassador Jasmine. When you put in inbox at inbox just now it came up with quite a few with the passwords with it. So if you go back to inbox, inbox, it looks as if the password is saved with that um, username. All right, good suggestion. Let me see. Just type, just... Yeah, yeah. go back. I think it was actually when you started typing the passwords. Yeah. Right. Inbox at inbox. And then for the password, so I should take, take that out, take that out. Take... Right. There you go. Check whether it's not in here. Right. There you go. Look. No, there no, was no. A, um... inbox is not inbox is not there, you see. It was. I can see it's not. Right. All right. It was take... there though. Take 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 everything out, Dr. Yeah. Linus. Take everything out. Take everything out. Take inbox dot inbox. Take no, take them all out. Take the username out as well. Take the username out. Yes. Type it in again. Right. So everything's empty. Right. Now type in inbox. No, oh. it's not there. If it was no, there, it would there. have come up. If it would, it would have come mm. up. Yeah. Mm. Uh, okay. Let me see. Uh, there is a possibility that I might have added it to my other account. I'm just going to check. Uh, I, I might not have. Just look for inbox. Nope. Oh. Are you sure, you no, sure it's should, not there. You sure, you sure I should have typed mailbox? Okay. Carry on with the next question. I'm going to try and see if I can get access to that password and I would log in, okay? Okay. And show everybody. I'll just stop sharing my screen for now. Please take the next right. question. And I will, I will look for the password. It's somewhere. Okay. All right. Uh, the next person that we are going to take is Gilbert. Gilbert, I know he would speak in French. Bonsoir, Gilbert. Vous avez la parole. Okay, bonsoir. Ça va bien. Très bien, très bien. Comment vous allez? Oh, Burundi, ça va bien. Ah, super. Vous avez la parole. Votre connexion est faible. 
mets ça dans la... Il faut, il faut, il faut écrire dans le message et je vais lire et puis je vais répondre. On ne vous entend pas, Gilbert. Je vais dire aujourd'hui... On ne vous entend pas, Gilbert. Ah, mais la connexion n'est pas... La connexion n'est pas bonne. Il faut écrire ça dans le message et puis on va, on va te revenir. On va, on va répondre. On va répondre. Écris ça dans le message, on va répondre. Ok. Super. Ok, super. Uh, Can we just find out if, how, how Peter, if Peter was successful? Because he, he was working in the yeah. background. Yeah, Peter, we see your hands up. Can, 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 you have the floor. Uh, yes, thank you so much. Um, I've tried to uh, go into password reset for connect. However, I get a timeout uh, message, error message. It says request timeout. I've tried several times, more than five times, and gives the same. Right, so it's, it's, taking, it's taking time to go through, and it's timing yeah. them out. So it's maybe a connection. Because you could see Sister Pauline is, is, um, was navigating her screen. Dr. Linus is navigating his screen. It's probably your I'm, connection. I'm just wondering, because uh, all other accounts, the Swifting Transact and the mailbox, it's over. I'm able to log in and do anything else. However, for Connect, it's just taking me to time out when I go to password reset. However, I'm able to access the link up to the part of uh, forgot password and then entering the email. So when I click submit, it goes to timeout. It goes to timeout. Yes. Um, can you go into the, the mailbox just to check? I've done that. Maybe I can just do that again. I've kept on refreshing also mailbox to just be sure that uh, maybe it hasn't gone. It has gone or nothing yet. But there's- Because sometimes uh, there's it could go. Okay. Sometimes maybe it's gone, but you have not seen it. So just let's just check I've, on the mailbox again. I've actually checked and refreshed. However, there's an email that I, I received uh, one hour ago. That is uh, when I think we're just starting the, this session and says, welcome to Swift Connect. I don't know. Would it yeah, be connected be the one? That? Yes. That Keep must that, be the mail. Yeah, th that's the one that we were probably working on be just before we came on air, Peter. Yes, yes. Okay, Sister Pauline, I think uh, I'm back in action on the email thing. The <laughs> mailbox actually didn't, uh, uh, it didn't exist. So that request could not have been sent. So, okay. but I have now created a mailbox and I can log into it. So Sister Pauline, can I just ask you, please share your screen, okay. identify that account and do a resend password, okay? Okay, so on. just go. To, so what you need to do then is go Recent to activation. pending. Go to pending. You need to do this on your admin account. On your oh, admin on my, account. On my admin. Okay. Hold on. Yeah. Let's, so maybe you, you have to, to go off, go off first, share, and then come back to your admin. Yeah, you don't need to share fine. your screen while you're doing that. I will share that's my screen and log into my mailbox. Okay. So what do I need to do? Nothing. No, you just go no, to admin. Do it off offline. Do it without every, admin, every, everyone of us. Okay. Box. And do a act, recent activation um, link. Recent acti activation link. Okay. Yeah. And in but the remember time, that the the okay. account will be on the in the pending pending yeah, bucket. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to pending, and okay. it's and it's called inbox, isn't it? Yes, we call it inbox. Inbox. Okay. While Sister Pauline is doing that, um, I am going to log into that inbox. No, it says no member found. Um, um, what do we call it? No, we called it test user. Sorry. Oh, that's it. Yeah, test, wasn't it? Yes. T-E-S. T-E-S, test. Okay, please, before you resend the activation link, uh -huh. uh, let me log into that mailbox first so that I'm already in when you send the link and we can right. all see the mail come in, okay? Yes, I, I found you. Very good. Please don't send the link just yet. Uh, 
I hope everyone can still see my screen. Right. Can I just, can I, sh um, before you show your screen, um, can I just show my screen? Because this is something Sister Pamela was, was complaining about, that she's not seeing her name and not seeing um, her downline. And I just want to show her very quickly. Oh, yes, please go ahead. Right. Can you stop sharing your screen, Dr. Linus? Yes. Right. So if I show my screen very quickly. Um, right. Sister Pamela, can you still there? Can you see? Can you see my screen? I am seeing your screen. Right. Yes. So automatically, my Swiffin number comes up, and automatically, my name comes up. So this is what will happen in your case. Okay. So it's automatically that person will be linked to you. Now remember, I didn't do none of the other information or anything like that. Yeah. So you don't have to worry about that. The other persons can do that later on, but you can see it's linked to me, the person's name and the person's email address. That's all that's required. And you can see my Swiffin number so that I know that this person will automatically be linked to me. Uh, yeah, thank you, but that's not what I said. No, but you were, com I remember you saying the Humpteen times ago that the people haven't been linked to you. No, so no. Sure, I was just showing you that if you no. do it this way, the person yes. will be linked to you. What I'm saying, I haven't been adding people by inviting them from inside my box. I've been sending them um information and they've been going away and doing it themselves yes and some of them been coming back to me and asking what do i do here now what do i do here now yes so what i'm saying those people would be linked to me until i go and add them which is a lot of people um i will have to get their emails their name and all that okay well we could we, we, that is another Yes, issue that we will have to cover at some other right. time. So right now what? we're going to stick on this. So what I said, Dr. Linus, I'm going to send you the re-verification link. Okay. Yes. Just before you click link, let me yes. log into the um the mailbox. Uh, connect. Okay. Just, just, just one moment, please. Just, please. Uh, connect <laughs> box. I just need to log into that. Tell All me right. when you're. Tell me when you're there, so I can send the revalidation email. Yep, I'm just going to start sharing my screen, and you'll know when I'm I'm there and ready to see it. So mm -hmm. that's my screen. Everyone can see it. And I'm just going to log into that mailbox. It's inbox at inbox.swiffen.com. And I know the password. Hopefully that's correct. So there you go. I'm in. And it says the list is empty because I haven't received any messages. So Sister Pauline, go ahead and resend the validation link, please. I'm sending it now. OK. And I'm just going to refresh. There you go. That's the message. There you go. It's been sent. It's been sent and it's been received. There it is. People who say, you see, hello, test user. You have been registered on the Swiftman platform, but first you need to validate your email. Now, when I click on this, it will be validated. Um, so let's click. Uh, participants can see your screen. Let me go. Let me go back there again and just click one more time. Can you see, thanks for registering. Uh, you shall receive a password shortly by email. You click OK. You then come back here and check your emails again. There will be another email with your password. There you go. And it says, uh, test user, that's your Swiffen ID. You don't get the Swiffen ID until you've validated your account. That's why the email is so important. Um, and then that is the password. And you can see we should be able to log into this account immediately. Uh, it is 6W61. So I'll go there and just enter that. It is 6W61. I can log in because it's been validated. It's asking me to put a new password so I can do it. 
Please delete this account afterwards. We have enough accounts on our system that we don't need. Absolutely. <laughs> that's fine. It will be deleted. But, you know, there you go. So, so that's it. I'm in. Now, if I go to broker, if I go to, uh, okay, I mean, now this account is here. I can actually register other people. This is the same screen that Sister Pauline showed earlier on. And all you have to do is click on in save and insert new member. And the beauty of this is you only need to specify the name and the email address. That's it. Yeah. The person can then log in and provide the rest of the other information. But this is the only guaranteed way for the account to be linked to yours. Okay. Um, I think I can stop sharing now. Thank you. And we've got quite a few hands up and um, um, time is, well, we've gone well over time. So what, how do you want to deal with this, please? Sister Pauline, I noticed that Kalim David has had his hand up for ages. Oh, yes, thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you, thank you, Ambassador Jasmine. Um, um, but going forward, and Kalim will be one of the last, but what do you want to do, um, Brother Ambi? You've been, you're muted, Brother Ambi, you're muted. Please unmute, sir. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Um, so can, I said we have overshot our time quite we, considerably. So we, can we, are going to, we can take yeah, a limb. We can take a limb. And that's the yeah. last. No. Oh. So we have Gilbert who raised his hand, but his audio was not good. He has posted the message on the on the chat. And I get what his, his issue is. I'm going to just talk through it. And then... Okay. Uh, we also have Callum David with that we are going to take as the last uh, person for today, yeah. where we would save the names of the three people who that we have not dealt with this evening and we'll start with them tomorrow. We have Vincent, we have Kimian Kase. Oh, Kimian's, Kingsley, just, Kimian's just come on, so let me just take Yes, it. and Kingsley Dyke. We'll yeah. deal with them. They are the first people as soon as we open and we get into the beating, we are going to deal with them first. So Gilbert's problem is that, and I think his problem is something that is very, very important that everybody should hear because I know, you know, haven't seen, uh, you know, just going through the account, we see those issues across different countries. So he's saying that when they were registering people before, <clears throat> there were a number of people who went on and registered people and only put one name. Yes. They didn't put the complete name. Yes. We are seeing that a lot of people like that uh, in the system. So he, and then he's saying that, how do they now help those people with the mailbox when the people only have one name? So, Uh, Gilbert, j'ai compris le problème que vous avez, ou bien la question que vous avez posée, que vous, que vous avez posée. Et je viens d'expliquer à tout le monde parce que ce, ce problème que vous, êtes en train que vous avez expliqué là se passe uniquement au Burundi. On, en, on voit ce problème dans plusieurs pays. Euh, euh, dans plusieurs pays. Donc, Voici ce que ce qu'on va faire. Pour tous ceux qui ont seulement un seul nom dans leur compte, il faudrait regarder, il faudrait euh, euh, qu'ils... Donc, avant de faire le euh, KYC sur Transact, il faut avoir leur carte d'identité. J'ai vu, il y a... Il y a, il y a une de nos de votre ou de vos compatriotes elle a même posté sa carte d'identité sur euh, sur connect ah, c'est bon c'est ouais elle a elle a elle a posté sa carte d'identité parce que les no he can't be talk he can't be talking at the same time his background's got to be clear his his lot of background knows where he is um donc Ce que vous allez faire, c'est que il faut prendre. Même, 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 même
si on, on a avoir les cartes d'identité, on peut avoir même les numéros de CENI. Numéro d'identité, c'est différent. Uh -huh. Même le nom, c'est identique. Ok, so, uh -huh. ok, so, yeah. so one part, no, j'ai compris, j'ai compris, oui, j'ai compris, so one part of his question was the fact that people have one name, the second part of his question was the fact that there are many people who have the same names, Sister Pauline and all the leaders, sister, brother Patrick, uh, who are here, you guys are aware how sometimes we go in and we put a name and you have a thousand people who have the same name, right? So he's saying that they have that same problem in Burundi where they have multiple people with the same names. So how do they make sure that they are different people. By using the email only address. Way, you have to use the people's names. The only way that they will be distinguished is by their account number. Because even if you have a thousand people with the same name, their account numbers would not be the same. So they have to make sure that they, 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 you know, they remember their account number, they save their account number in a place that they can easily access. So I'm going to share that with him. But can, you, Gilbert, can, you, can you tell him the email address as well? Because if they've got the same person, then we can yeah. have just really identify that person, please. Thank you. No, but also if they have the same name, it would be, it means that when they want to create the email address, it could potentially be the same email address. Yes, but, but they, they can't. Oui, moi, if someone uses mais, um, Pauline, mais, mais, Pauline, Pauline one, yeah. Uh -huh. That person can, can Pauline one cannot be Pauline one can't be Pauline one Go cannot ahead. be created again. So he, that next person have to use Pauline two or Pauline three or Pauline four five six. Pauline but one the is point taken. Is they may not be in the same place. Remember yeah. that people are registering in different parts. Yeah, so yeah. You, you it, it, it's not easy to coordinate that. So let me let me just talk to him about. The, the names. Donc, Gilbert, la situation, c'est que s'il y a plusieurs personnes avec le même nom, la distinction de ces individus, c'est leur numéro de compte. Ils ne peuvent pas avoir les mêmes numéros de compte. Donc, il y a une, voici le premier niveau de distinction parmi les, les différents membres. OK Pour les différents membres, voici, le, voici la distinction, le numéro de compte. OK? Uh, I think we lost him. Connection in, in Burundi is not very good this evening. Callum, David, you are the next. And then we are saving the, re the rest of the people for tomorrow. Yeah, I've got them down. I've got written them down. Evenings, evenings. I just wanted to know, I think it's on Saturday. We can't go into the system i have yes. seen no. i have seen that a lot of people are complaining that there's no connection in cape town i i think what we'll do we'll check which is the server that you guys are connecting to in cape town and then okay. when okay. we come to the well, meeting tomorrow we can't work now yeah i understand that there's a, a lot of people have even sent me messages on whatsapp that they are not connecting in uh, in Cape Town. Okay, thank you. Yes. Can I, like that right can, I, can I ask you no, what browser it's been, you're it's using, been Kalim? Since the weekend, I've got a lot of messages, um, and I kept I kept telling them to just disconnect and go back. And it's not. It looks uh, as uh, if uh, it doesn't the take server us that we're connecting to in around right. Cape Town no, is, the, has not been connected. Can since. I? Can I? Can I? Um, just say so, um, Sister Kalem, what what um browser are you using? Uh, we use the Wi-Fi. Yeah, but are you using Chrome? Um, Firefox. Chrome. 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 It's yeah. Chrome. Chrome is a <laughs> Chrome is Google. Okay. <laughs> and they cause issue. Um, and the reason why I'm saying that is, um, I had the same issue using Chrome. And it, and it used to fire me out. 
all the time. And I used to get the 502 error or 503 yeah, error. So what do we do? Um, what I did to rectify that problem, and it's not for everyone, but it helped me. I use um, the um, Firefox or Brave browser. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just another browser. It's very simple. It's very, it's the same as Chrome. Yeah, it's the same okay, as Google okay. Chrome, but it, you get a, a better reception. And the, that server seems to be stronger that's able to connect with Swiffin. But the Chrome is, is, is Gmail, just like the emails are having problems coming through via from Swiffin. Anything to do with Google at the moment, there seems to be a slight delay or block or something like that. So anyone here that's using Chrome and having this issue, try using another browser, Firefox, Brave, um, Edge. And, uh, uh, sorry, what's that? What was that one? There's also Edge, I think. Oh, there you go, Edge. Yeah, it. They see you seem to get a better reception from those particular browsers, and it's just something going forward. Uh, in case anyone is having issues with the Chrome, okay? Okay, okay. Thank you, Sister Pauline. So, You're welcome. So try that, but we are also going to check whether it's a okay, thing, something we'll do. linked to we'll the do. local server. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay. Thanks. Thanks so much, Doctor Linus. Did you had something that you wanted to say? Um, I have actually. I can't remember what I wanted to say now. Okay. Uh, I think Kingsley Dyke just put his question on the, you know, on the chat to say his problem is that his KYC has not been validated. <laughs> Kingsley, just a quick response to that. We have prioritized people who are transacting from account to transact for validation of their KYC. But in the meantime, we are also working on um, reducing the backlog on KYC on Transact. There's some, you know, a lot of work going on on that, on that front. So, and one of the things that you must bear in mind is that we are trying to always go on a first come, first serve basis. Um, so we will, will definitely come to your account. Okay. So, as you know, I, I think we've come to the end of the session today. It's been a great session. We've spent, you know, time. We had a visitor and we've looked at some really, really critical elements of access and, um, and, and, and transactions on the platform. As I want to take this opportunity to thank every one of you for making the time and taking the effort on a daily basis to take this movement to the next level. And we are going for, we are going for, the, for, for, the, um, for the high numbers that we had set for ourselves as a community this year. Um, I see Brother Elad is here. Good evening, Brother Elad. Um, <clears throat> we didn't see you earlier, we're, we're looking for you, but we are now at the end of the meeting. We are looking forward to our session tomorrow Hopefully we would have um, two of the, you know, you know, one of, you know, the, the one of the leaders from the executive and um, a guest. We are hoping we're going to have that tomorrow. So invite, a few, you know, uh, 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 people who are, you know, that you can invite so that we can, um, you know, this leader, they can also hear directly from some of the executive leaders as we bring them on one one uh, as we go forward. Um, thank you all very much. Thank you so much. Dr. Linus. Uh, thank you very much, Brother B, and thanks uh, to everybody uh, who was able to participate this evening. Thank you, Sister Pauline, for the coordination. Uh, it's been another very successful session where I hope we're all walking away having learned something from the experiences of our members across the globe. Um, let's keep moving. Let's keep um, driving this to another level. Focus remains inclusive access for all and the use of a common instrument of exchanging value. And as you can see yourself from what is happening, there is a lot going on in the background. And this year is a critical year 
where we expect to see significant growth in numbers. Uh, the challenges that we're having with the emails, we have a solution now that is very smooth. You've seen it yourself. So we encourage all members to move to the Swiffen mailbox as soon as they can, so that registration could be and can be as smooth as ever and as simple as you have seen demonstrated here uh, during this session. So thank you very much and God bless you. Look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you all so much. Good night. Good, Good night. night, everyone. Good night. Good night. 8.30 tomorrow, night. South night. Africa time. Good night. Okay. Thank you. Good night. Good night from Zambia. Good, Good night, night, everyone. Good night. Yeah. Good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night.